Oh, you do the intro, after. man. I've deep the last. No, you haven't. A hundred. So you don't want to do an intro for another. So but no, the last cool. four, uh, in it, the last like we're, four we're eps, I've about. done them. See, love, love, I, lo- I love you guys as a yeah, combo, man. Online. Thank really you. Like good, isn't it? No, Jenny, very good. No, that's good. why I think you should come. Uh, yeah. Me. Wow. Amazing stuff. Thanks. So Thanks today's for intro will be done by Lovely, one of your man. favorite human beings, Chunks. All right, so guys, we are back on the Chunks and Philly show now. In the middle of us, guys, generally, probably one of my favorite content creators on the face of the internet. Mm. Hey, guess me. Um, a very good soul. Yeah. Thank you. Very hilarious. Mm. The beautiful. Nella. Yeah. No, oh. no, you have to... Big Bonda. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah Biggest yeah, yeah, yeah. Bonda. <laughs> yeah. Is Nella Rose? <laughs> Hi, friends. How are you, Nella? Great. Can I just say you look very beautiful? Thank you. You've given me a lot of compliments lately. Thank you. So was I looking like a man before? No. So but, what happened? Because they're no. coming as of recent. As in, so what was I looking like before? What maybe, was I walking maybe around? I'm, someone else said that to me, actually, on my Instagram. Mm-hmm. I've been bigging up Nella a lot recently. Maybe you've just been glowing a lot so, recently. So I was a rat before, innit? Nah, so rat the, is mental. On the highway. On the highway. Yeah. She was AJ Shabill. <laughs> um, I'm not involved. So, I'm not so involved. Nels, I think we've got to start with you. I feel yes. like even though we're all mates, mm. I feel like at the same time, there's a lot about you that I might not know. Really? Yeah. Ask me anything, man. Um... Let's start with maybe why your family migrated from mm. <clears throat> from Belgium. So, obviously, my whole family, mum and dad, they was based in Congo, living it up, enjoying the sun, the palm trees, living it all. And then um, I think there was like this massive propaganda in Africa where it's like, there's better opportunities in Europe. Mm. You can go and start a life in Europe. There's more more money. They can give you housing, more jobs, this, that, and the other. So um, I guess my parents fell for it. They came here. They knew <laughs> each other. Fell for it. Like, they definitely <laughs> fell for it. And then, so they went to Belgium actually, yeah, to just start a new life. And then um, obviously divorces happen. Mm. You get me? I'm a product of divorce, but look at me, I'm Leng. Same, 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 same. <laughs> it is what it is. Yeah, it is what it is. Yeah. Bro, so I'm then, a product of divorce, but look at me, I'm Leng. Period. It doesn't That's... even correlate. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, what are you trying to say? I'm not Leng. No, I'm not saying that, but how does that even make sense? So what? You can't be divorced. Because I was a rat. On the highway. On the highway. So then, Chill. obviously, mum and dad split up. And then as a woman, I hear my mum in it. You do not want to wake up every day and just have to look at your ex. (laughs) (laughs) So if it's a fly overseas thing, it's a fly Fly overseas overseas because it's like, I don't want to be at the corner shop, see my ex. I'm picking up my kids. I see my ex. I just, we're we're going for a breakup. I don't want to see So they broke up in Belgium? Yeah. No, they broke up in um, Congo. Portugal. (laughs) So they broke up in Belgium. How how, how long until you guys being in Belgium did they break up? Uh, Bro, I can't even lie. I think I opened my eyes and I had two yards. So I don't even I don't really remember. Yeah, yeah. That means that how she was before she was, your fight. She was young. Yeah, so I've I've never seen my mum and dad like together. together. Okay, okay. Yeah, so yeah, um, before, before you were five, four then. Yeah, yeah, way before, before I could remember, definitely. Last two, three. Way yeah. before I was probably a baby. Anyways, now, um, so then my mum was just like, yeah, I live in the same ends as my ex, like I'm just bumping into him, his brother, his this, his that, and I hear it. It's no, like, I hear it. I was like, run away. So she was like, oh, what's local? Germany, eek, scary. Yeah. Um, Netherlands, eek, scary. <laughs> Them hood rat, red men, yow, welcome, welcome. <laughs> it's, it's, it's difficult to learn that one. So she was thinking, oh, like, obviously at the time she was a big fan, eh, Princess Diana, oh, Princess good. Diana the Queen. Yeah. So then obviously, again, she fell for it again. Bless my mom oh, now. So obviously growing up in Belgium, yeah, whenever you see the UK on TV, it's like you see the Queen, you see like Houses of Parliament, Big Ben. Oh, the Big Ben is big. Yo, yeah, 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 the yeah, Big yeah. Ben is one, like one, one, uh, what do they call it in Dubai? Uh, Khalifa. I Be- I Be- Be- oh, in Dubai. Sorry. Be- sorry, sorry. I lost my soul there. Sorry. Be- what Bas- <laughs> in Dubai. In Dubai. Yeah. yeah. Eiffel Tower. Yeah. And that's exactly. Philly. Yeah. That's why we love it. Yeah. yeah. Lost it. Great. Sorry. Spot on that one. So she saw all of that stuff, yeah. And obviously in Belgium, when you wear school uniform, you go to a private school. So you, when you wear a tie and a blazer, you go to a private school. So everyone wears normal gear. So then we used to see schools in the UK. It's for everyone's private. <laughs> the, 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 all the schools are private and free. So my mom said, nah, Princess Diana, my queen, Princess Diana, everything. Our private school, she said, oh, 
I'm gonna go to the UK. Pull up to the UK now. You, you haven't mentioned dad, so dad stayed in. He's booling in Belgium. Yeah, but because dad, my dad had multiple businesses and multiple Jeez. kids. So it's like, that's where his base is. Do you know what I mean? Mm. He's had a baby mom that went to France. All these baby moms go to neighboring oh, countries. Oh, you had bare baby moms? No, nah, but it's, it's called P-I-M-P. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what you heard about me. Like, copyright, copyright. Yeah, yeah. 50 Cent's not giving us tickets to his last tour, so. <laughs> 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 Anyways, so yeah. No, nah, this should be called the Nella show. You know where it gets to there, innit? No, 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 I'm sorry. I just want to say, Nella. This is what I yeah, she's incred. She's yeah. running the whole show. Yeah, this you is know, incred. I'm, I'm like this. Yeah. I need to be asking a question. And I do this. Yeah. I, just, uh, I need to stop staring. Go on. Yeah, that's absolutely fine. But remember, I was a rat before, so staring now is that, fine. That brother, that brother we met at, at your party was, is he your dad side? Same, no, same mom, same dad. Oh, okay, okay. Look. But uh, yeah, long. So then he's back there because he said, no, nah, I'm not falling for the propaganda. He Stayed in back. Belgium. He went back. Recently, Car- actually. Disney? Yeah, so basically... Um, we pulled up now. She was like, oh, like the way they're showing the UK, like Spice Girls at the time is out. Like the way they're showing the UK on TV, that's where I want to be. So it's like one one train or one ferry away from the kids' dad so they can see him whenever. Mm. He's got money, he can come. Do, mm. you know, do you know what I'm saying? He's not just st- stay there in, in the little house. So then she was just like, yeah, so then I remember the, f- I, I remember my first day in this country, you guys, I could cry, yeah. But uh, we pull up, I'm expecting the roast to be gold. <laughs> yeah, I was expecting, you know, the horses, in the, the police on the horses, they're go, 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 go. I said, I'm expecting everything. Pull up at Victoria Station, I see pigeons everywhere, scattered everywhere. And we had nowhere to stay, so we was posted up. If Victoria stays there, I said, Ross, I have to go night night here. Night night. So we just wake up, pigeons flying everywhere. Wait, and you then the Victoria Station? Yeah, That's because marginal. basically, yeah, basically, so I think it's illegal. Now that I've, I'm grown, yeah. I think it's illegal. But basically, there was this guy, we'll call him Mr. D, yeah? he owned a three bedroom flat. And um, I think it was for like like immigrants, like people like us oh, coming from. In that. Yeah, so he had a three bedroom flat, and I think he slept in like the dining room. And then, so yeah, we all three of us we had to share like a single room. Yeah, that's a time. hustler. He's a hustler. Until my mum got yeah, a job. Least. Yeah, but yeah, I think that was illegal. No, it's illegal. Nah, it's illegal. yeah, because we had to pay him cash. Yeah, of course. yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah <laughs> you know, yeah, under yeah, the yeah. table. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's, it's illegal. But um, yeah, and then from there, just went to school. Um, and then just started my life really. And then look at me, I've got no French accent now. I'll tell you that for free. Mm-mm-mm-mm. That's mental. And then that's me. So do you, if you had it your way, would you have stayed in Belgium? No, because then I wouldn't have a career because- Yeah, but you're saying that now because yeah. you like, you're here and you're Nella Rose, but mm. you know what I mean? Like, yeah, like, would no, you, okay, how old were you when you started YouTube? Or like start 18. Like, okay, so at 17 years old, if I was to ask you, do you uh, is Nella enjoying London and is she happy with the decision? What would you say? I would have said yes, because I was in college. college. College was a movie. Oh, yeah, Do you know what I mean? But simply, I simply say yeah. that because it's like, if you want to blow in like the French industry, <coughs> you have to be, not even in France, you have to be in Paris or Toronto. Uh, Do you know what I mean? Not even Toronto, but like Canada. Do you know what I mean? Like in Belgium, it's very much like, there's not many influencers, not many like rappers and singers. There are some, but it's like, it's very like, to me, it's a town. It's very much like, much like you go there to like raise your kids or like be in community with people, but opportunities, there's no foot asylum. There's no European foot asylum, for example. Mm. Like where, what platforms would I go on to like yeah. do things like yeah. this? There's no platforms like that. So. <clears throat> yeah. So I don't think I would be where I am today. That's why everything happens for a reason. She, my mom saw Princess Diana on the TV for a reason, fam. There you go. I'm telling you. Who was you closer growing up with? Was it mom or dad? Uh, it's like 50-50 because they both have two different styles of raising me, for example. I go to my dad's house. <laughs> <laughs> Ew, my dad, no rules. You want to go come back 5 a.m.? In fact, come in at 6 just just so that you can take the piss out of me because I know I trust you. Oh, I thought it'd be the other no, way around. No, no, no. You know, my I, dad... I, 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 I would agree with Nah, you. my dad... My dad was like my big brother. Like, so cool, so chill. But he instilled principles in me. Like, he told me men are trash before men, men were trash because he said... He said, my daughter, look at me. <laughs> he, said, he, said, he said, look at how many baby moms I've how got. Many, how many has he got? got? Well... Allegedly, <laughs> like probably five. Allegedly, because wow, seed spreader, <laughs> big up, big Paul, big Paul. Yeah. You get me? So then, Seed's yeah. So brother. he and obviously he had ninety um, percent daughters. Mm. So he he was very much like 
Look at all the mistakes I've made in my life. I've had to let go of some women that I still love to this day because I was a dog sort of thing. No, so it's like, deep. he instilled, he didn't want us to like go out on the streets and like seek attention from men. I think that's, that was his like worst nightmare. Yeah. I think I would even keep him up at night sometimes, you know. But um, yeah, so he would always tell us like, if a guy tells you this, it's a lie and this, that. So when we would go out, he'd be like, my daughters ain't doing stupidness. Like they're not gonna yeah, go out. Like, he was confident in that. So that's why he went straight. Mm, my mum on the other hand hey. yeah yes you must see at the zambe yeah well yeah. So that was, that was, Yo, yeah, that was mama, crazy my mum was more like everyone out there can kill you <laughs> do you know what i mean like you lock the doors you come home at this time don't talk to strangers this that and other and when i was growing up i didn't really understand it because i used to be like oh but like my brother could go out and come back but I have to be home at a certain time. So I used to be like, oh, mom, like I'm in prison, this, that, and the other. Hey, yo, mommy, thank you. I would have been a slapper. <laughs> Brother, I would have been a slapper. <laughs> Let me tell you just that. Just free in it. Yeah, because I was just like, <laughs> no, I'm <hey>. outside. <laughs> hey, I'm outside. But those are just listening. If you saw what Chunks did, oh, yeah, at least. letting it off. <laughs> outside, like, brother. Yeah, yeah. But like, now she instilled like yeah. discipline in me. Do you know what I mean? And and now I feel like both my parents, even though I've only seen them in a the room together like twice my whole life, yeah. Wasn't they it weird seeing that? Like you think you're right. I was like, why are you faking it? I just punch him up. <laughs> <laughs> I, but in that same breath, so like mm. I'm different to you in the sense that my parents are also divorced, yeah. Mm. But I, there was a period of time when everyone was in the yard. And even though like overall the vibes were a bit toxic because of my dad, yeah. there was good times. Yeah. So like when they proper got a divorce, I was affected by that. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. So like, was it was it their times? Even like when you saw them in a room together, didn't you ever think like, oh, I'd be lit if my mum and dad were together? You know? <laughs> no. I think mama would check him every day. Is it, yeah. No, bless this man. No, 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 no. Free my man. Um, no, no, uh, well, no. Maybe no. didn't you just wish like, rah? Wish no. I had both my parents together. Do you know why? And it because, was perfect. Nah, no. simply I never wanted that because I lived a double life. Do you I get it? it. I so it. it's I like at mum's house, A star student, school council, this, that, and the other. Dad's house, we are sad. Yeah, so yeah, it's yeah, like yeah, if yeah, they yeah. were together now, <laughs> like, can't really be like outside, I wouldn't, yeah, yeah, I wouldn't have. Yeah, 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 like yeah, 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 yeah. there'd be no balance. Yeah. yeah. So what about, what about you? So did your mum end up ever remarrying, or did your dad end up remarrying? Or? For why? Oh. My mum. My mum. <laughs> my mum said. Yeah, I think it's both parents that instilled the men are trash, you know. It was them. No, it was them. Because people think it's social media. It was them. My mum was just like, I've had my kids. Um, good. Like, oh, I'm going to focus, like, my whole life on, like, doing the things that make me happy. Because I think she was kind of robbed of her childhood when you have to, like, oh, so move. Was my yeah, so, yeah. So she was the oldest of all her siblings. So you know that second mum, basically. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Oldest of all her siblings. Then moving from a young age, you have to find a job. Like, you don't, you don't have time to, like, have fun and go out. And then, so... Old, so your whole life, you're basically a mother to all these siblings. Then you move here, you've got to find a job and put your feet down. Then you have kids, you've got to be a wife and a mother. So I think when she came out of that relationship, she was like, baby, my life starts now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I was, I was thinking that maybe like settling down with someone else would have like, I don't know. I think it would have cop blocked her still. Like she was living her best. Like what weekends in Paris just to buy perfume? Mm, cold. What? Hard. Hard. Like I, I I do think that though, yeah, but then you see as I've got older and I've learned to like understand my mum's situation, mm. like my mum's single, innit? Mm. And then I think sometimes like surely my mum desires a hug that's not from her children. Do you get what I'm saying? It's the same way I don't know, your brother in the room right now mm. could give you a hug, but sometimes you want a hug and a kiss on the cheek that's not from your brother. Do you get what I'm saying? Like so, so sometimes I look at that side More often like, than not. E even though your mom could have been gassed at that time, there, yeah. there must have been times where she was like, oh, do you know what? It would have kind of been nice to have this lunch with someone and this coffee by the Eiffel Tower. Rather of course. Than, you know, right. Right. I, I never asked you know her. I, mean? I never feeling. asked her to know. No? Is yeah. Because yeah. my mom tells me that all the time. She goes like, you got to look at it like this. Basically, my mom had this, she was seeing this man once and I was mm. so rebellious. Like, And then my mom hit me with this one. She goes, how about when you're married and your sisters are married and you've got to take your youth dance class and then your, my, your other sister's taking her child football and ballet. Mm. Like, what? who am I left with? And that's when it really hit that's home. That's deep. I, was like, I hear it. Like, as much as I'm going to be there for my mum, like I've always said, like, when I get my crib, my mum's going to live in the yard with me. Do you get what I'm saying? Mm -mm. But then 
she hit me a bit and she was like, but one day it might come to a halt. Like you might, do you get what I'm saying? So yeah, yeah, I, hear, yeah. I hear it, I hear it. Like I, I feel like as much as you're saying that, again, could be wrong, innit? Cause mm. unfortunately mum's not here. You feel yeah. me to, to ask her, but I feel like she must've at one point. Maybe. You know what I mean? One yeah, but it's maybe because she had that relationship with her daughter as well or whoever, like mm. that she wouldn't even let you know how she's feeling mm. in terms of I couldn't, like, oh, but I it's, it's different. Like, cause you see how you're older. Mm. I think oh, how, yes. how, old are you? how, um, yeah, I lived with my mom until I was 18. So oh, okay. yeah, That's so enough, yeah. I feel like with having a daughter, I think if I moved out, maybe she would have like, mm done all of that stuff like explore the romance mm. but i feel like having a daughter bringing a man to come live in your yard yeah, yeah, yeah it's nuts do you actually know him like yeah, is yeah, he yeah, gonna yeah. move weird is he gonna look at me mm-hmm. is he gonna because you know me i'm a sexy beast just yeah, walking yeah, yeah, around yeah, the yeah. house like this like sexy beast. you you this never know yeah you, you never know so, yeah. exactly but <laughs> <laughs> i'm a nigga from the congo <laughs> from the congo you see me fighting with the grizzly bear help the bear <laughs> Help the bear! <laughs> How crazy yeah. that is! Hear it, though. Hey. Hear it. Yeah. That's me, guys. Um, yeah, obviously, your pops did definitely didn't have that issue in it, car. He was oh. out here spreading it. Outside. You get me? Outside. No. Like, he lived his best life to the end of his life. Literally, like, enjoyment. Mm. Lived it up. What a man. Oh. When, when, did, when did pops pass? 2020. April 2020, a couple weeks before his birthday. Yup. Mum was before that, right? Yeah, mum was when I was 19. So mum was 2016. How old are you now, Nels? 26. 26. 26, yeah. Can I ask how both happened? Um, I can't, I'm not answering it now because I'm answering it on my platform. Sick. Okay, but I can't hear it. Every, everyone will know simply because like um so basically i filmed a video where i explained it all i remember you showed me the one yeah. you're petting to upload yeah yeah and the reason because yeah, she's cause petting you know, to upload it very petty so I, no it, not not petty you're like yeah, she's like she's I'm she's just, stunting like i'm it's hard pro- for her procrastinating her yes that's the word yes. mm. that's the word sorry yes. me and my hood self but um yeah no i'm gonna talk about it. i didn't talk about it for years well still to this day yeah, no yeah, one yeah, on social media kind of knows but the reason why i'm talking about it now is because so many people lose parents it's not just me. Yeah, like, of course, it's, yeah. it's not just me. Like, yeah, oh my god, she's an author and all this. Okay, cool. But people see my story and they're like, oh, like she done it. She's all right, so I can do it too. Mm. So I did a whole video explaining how both happened, how both affected me, how it happened on the day, everything. Yeah, Ooh. just so that like the people that have gone through it are going through it. Like having a parent that's sick for a very long time is something that I've experienced twice. Do you know what I mean? So just to help people through, like it's not every day just come on my channel. Oh, oh my god, what's she wearing today? Oh my god, she got a new wig. Sometimes come on, come on my platform Features, for yeah. like for strength. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? So for yeah, strength. I do, I do delve into it, um, just to help people out there, like, and I do kind of like want to talk about like the aftermath, how to deal with things and stuff like that. Because when it happened to me, I had no clue. Like there was no video on YouTube on like how to deal with blah blah blah. Mm. Do you know what I mean? It was just like just us, literally us trying shit. Mm. so just yeah i am definitely going to talk about it but it's not it's not a subject that i'm closed off to because i've healed do you feel like that but at the same time though do you feel like it's mm. something you have to talk about no that's why i didn't talk about it for years okay yeah, yeah, of course bro because obviously my yes. mom passed 2016 and then mm-hmm. pops passed 2020 it's been literally like my mom my mom passed a year no a couple months into me starting youtube and deep how long I've been on YouTube for. I, oh, I haven't wait, talked so about it. Didn't mom do get to see? Yeah, she saw, saw, she no, saw first three videos. Like, no. But she knew though. Yeah, yeah. She, she knew. Yeah, yeah she, be, why, she used what, to call. What, both what, my parents, yeah. Imagine, both my parents didn't talk to each other and they would call me the same thing. So they will call it like my star in French, which means like, oh, like you're, you're a star. And they've been saying that from young. And they both had the same nickname for me. And they didn't even talk on the phone to even just about to what even, nickname to have to give this child. So... They both knew. Like my mom would always tell me, like, oh yeah, like she she'd see a nice car on the road and she'd be like, You're gonna buy me that one day. Da, da, da. I'm thinking, I was like, with what money? But she knew. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> so then when I started YouTube, she was like, hmm. She was just like, Oh, is that you and your little friends? I was like, Yeah, she was like, hmm. Like, you know that little like she knows yeah, it's gonna yeah, flourish. But, it. but let me not gas her too yeah. much. So she'll be like, Oh, is that your friend? Hmm. And then she'll tell my brother, Oh, can you can you put it up on the laptop? Yeah, right. She would have been gassed, didn't it? So gassed. She would have been spoiled too. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh my god. god. You have to. Die. Her leg, her nails were like this, yeah? yeah, this length my whole life. So imagine in this day and age, fam, her nails would have been yeah, the size would've... of my hand. <laughs> fam, <laughs> crazy things, crazy. Um, dad obviously got to reap it. 
Yeah. Like that and oh, see it. my my dad enjoyed, bro. He enjoyed. He stopped tell, working. Tell him, tell him about um, uh, him as in chunks. Tell chunks the story mm. about when you look wet in Japan. So we, sorry, the way I flipped my head. Yeah. So imagine, like yeah, story. so we went, there's bare stories about Japan. So my dad, I just used to just like, whenever I would get time off, I'd be like, yo, what are we doing? Because he liked to travel the world, innit? Mm. So I was like, oh, dad, like, oh, like, what what are we doing this time? Like, where are we going? He was just like, I want to go to Tokyo. I was like, you, what are you <laughs> on? So like, what are you <laughs> on? He was like, I want to go to Tokyo. So I was just like, okay, let's go. Book T8 went there now. I was living the, the time of our lives, yeah. And then we were just like, oh. Like, what do we eat? You want a sushi, man? What? Yes. We was like, what do we eat? What do we eat? We saw shark. We saw whale. We saw horse. We went to Hooters. <laughs> we went to Ho- Hooters. Wait, wait. So, wait, wait, wait. We went to Hooters now. No, fit deep How in. are you in Tokyo, guy, Hooters? No, but listen to this. Because we was thinking that like, we don't even know what this is. We yeah. don't know what that is. So, we see Hooters. So, now, growing up in the UK, I see, like, Hooters, Wendy's. as like, oh, American. Yeah, we disease. can get yeah. fried. Titties on the main. Yeah, titties. Oh, yeah. So I'm thinking, oh, it's like a Wendy's. Like, we can go there, get fries, burgers, everything. Going to Hooters now. What's Blasphemous. What happened? I think she put her titties on the desk before she agreed. <laughs> before she even greeted us. Uh, all turned around. That'd be my favourite place. I was like, what, oh, Japanese, honestly, my dad loved it. But Japanese? I said, huh? Japanese girl? Nah, there was like American girls in there as well. Like, blondes. Every pop So I was just yeah, like... I was like, oh, we a burger. I was like, Daddy, I, I can't even explain this word. But um, we we had good. Yeah, it was nice. <laughs> oh, yeah, that, <laughs> you yeah. said that it was nice. Um, <laughs> it was nice. Online, we see obviously as well when black people go to them sort of countries. Yeah, I'm mm. sure both of you might have seen it mm. that they treat everyone like it's Shaquille O'Neal and LeBron James. Yeah. Royalty. Yeah. Did you lot get that same treatment there? And yeah, how was it? Time. Did your dad find it annoying? Every time. Was it lit? Nah, my dad was like, um, my dad's the type of person he would just play along. Say so every time people came up to me, yeah, yeah, I'm her manager, and he would try like ask people for tips. Like, if they want a picture with me. Bear in mind, these people aren't coming up to me because I'm Nella. They're coming up to yeah, me because yeah, I'm black. black. They're like, oh, Cardi B, Cardi B. She's six shades lighter than me. Like, you don't even know what mental. Cardi B looks like, bro. You're just saying any random black names. Yeah, and then, yeah. So, yeah, we was just, we was playing along with it. It was, it was jokes. I can't lie. Mm. That's a cool memory. Like, people coming. He was like, yeah, man, yeah. Because he, everywhere he went, he wore a suit. The Congolese, Congolese yeah. in it. Was it the Congolese suits? Well, with the, with the it's the drinks. Congolese in him. Uh, when I was yeah. in the suits, were they Congolese off? No, 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 no. no. My dad, drinks. my dad, yeah. Oh my games. god! Before people come and think, there was no leather jackets. There was no crocodile shoes. Please, it oh, was just cool. like, just like nice, like Ooh. Calvin Klein. Like he, Ooh. I mean, his kids, his kids give him money, yeah, and he's got a lot of kids, and uh, we all love him off, like yeah. dad of the year, love him off. So he was good, like, do you know what I mean? So he was just. Eh. Sapology, very nice all the time. But um, yeah. So he was just like, yeah, I'm a manager. Cold. And taking pictures with people, I was just like, oh so my. So you have loads of like half brothers. You just and, and yeah. Like, so oh. besides my brother Albert, who's one year older than me, everybody is half. And are you close with them or are you not? All of them. I'm all close. Them. I'm close with all of them. Simply because it's like we've, like the way my dad raised us. Yeah, it's like you might all have different mums but you're my children. Mm. You are siblings. So for example, in my household, calling somebody like, oh, that's my half sister, blasphemy. I love that. Like that I is so that. disrespectful. We don't even run that. Like my sister's mixed race. Like, and I'm not going to go around and be like, oh, by the way, her mum's white. It's, no, that's my sister. What, yeah, what you got to say? Yeah, Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. So the way we was raised, it's very much like the bond between siblings. And also we had bonds. So I have bonds with my sister's mums as well. So it's like when things go happening, like say, for example, my sister's side of the family, as us as the siblings, we come together. So it's like, well, one big, happy, blended family. Like, and I love it. Uh, I love it. My, her, my sister speaks Dutch. One of my oh. sisters speaks Dutch. They've got a sister in France, but then mainly everyone's in that Belgium. But I love it though, because it's just like, yeah, like gang. <laughs> There's oh. pair of us. I love it. So wait, you know, um, <coughs> so did you, was, was you living with your mom when she passed? Oh uh, yeah. And so what ended up happening? Like, do you, oh, I spoke about this. So basically, I lived in Graham Park, right? Yeah. And everybody knows Graham no, Park is. TP, yeah, yeah. Man said G. That's, what, we, that's what they call it. Yeah, mm. but chill out. You, yeah. you lock. They're knocking it. Down. Oh yeah, sorry. What, what's this one? S E. Trying to say GP. Go GP back in the days, please, man. Have a good time, man. You come out with a one shoe. My life. Don't play shit. This still motorbikes in it. Oh no. GP. I loved. I loved living there though. It was like a. It was like an adventure. 
Like, what's happening today? Yeah. Sort of thing. And I used to live at the top. So my window, everybody knew Nella's outside the window like this with a cup of tea, just, who's beefing now? Yeah, <laughs> like, it was lit. Yeah. But anyways, yeah, so that's council flats, right? Yeah. And um, obviously when, so I was 19, my brother was 20, but apparently, Albert. yeah, Albert. But when you reach the age of 18, yeah, 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 you yeah, have yeah, to yeah. bid for a council flat. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. if you don't bid for a council flat, then you're not on the list to get a flat. Say you want one or say anything happens, right? Is it, yeah. Yeah. So then, so when my mom passed, we were just like, okay, cool. At least we have like the yard. We can just keep paying it. It's council flat. You can't get kicked out of a council flat sort of thing. Mm. So we were just like, oh, like we can just keep paying it and just stay here. Cause I mean, we've lived here for like what, 10 plus years. I'm like, where, where else are we gonna go? Sort of thing. And then um, we get a letter through the post basically saying that we got a dip because I didn't bid for a council flat. Cause I was thinking I'm going uni and then my brother didn't bid for a council flat. Cause he's like, my my brother and my mom besties by the way. So he's like, I'm gonna stay here and look after mumsy sort of thing. So they just basically kicked us out um and they were like you're both over the age of 18 anyway so it's not like it happened when i was like 12 and my brother was well, 13. even though he was paying rent yeah because it's, it's about it's about like say there's a mother <coughs> say there's a mother of three mm. right now that's looking for a house oh yeah 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 yeah, yeah. yeah. understood sorry carry on with the story yeah, they'd right, rather right. take the the, the 19 right. and 20 yeah, year old yeah, out yeah, and then right. put it so, so then that happened and then my brother was like he tried like staying here but I think everyone just likes it more over in Belgium. It's peaceful, it's nice. I like, said, oh, he said, he said, what you're doing YouTube? Yeah, it's going good for you, yeah? Right, you don't need me no more. He went oh, back. Gosh. But I see him all the time though, because it's so local. Yeah, it's yeah, quicker yeah. to get to Brussels than Manchester by train. Yeah, two hours. That's crazy. Literally. So yeah. That's Nuts. crazy. So then what, so you ended up going to uni and then staying in uni? Uh, yeah, so I stayed in, so from, second year to third year i stayed in uni accommodation and then i paid for um you can pay to stay there the summer okay yeah so from second year to third year i just paid extra to stay there the summer but i was in belgium like it was just somewhere that all my a stuff base, can yeah. be in yes. and then i can just pack up and go like i went after a nation i came yeah. back like i went i went bare places so, um so as a as a 19 year old you're 19 at the time yeah 19, 19 20, yeah, yeah. yeah. How could you still attend uni? How was your mentor at the time? Oh, I waited to quit. I waited to quit. I remember I sent like a BC to all my friends. I was like, yeah, you lot ain't going to see me again, blah, blah, blah. I was very sad. And then it's like, you know, when you lose a parent, yeah? It's like you're grieving them, but then there's so much other stuff. Like, like did they have a life insurance? Blah, 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 blah. Like, just that like, you have to do so much stuff that you actually don't have time to mourn that you don't yeah, you so yeah and then out. i was just thinking and then it happened start of summer and then end like not end of summer but like september times you gotta go back to you know i was thinking that's not enough time um but then i was just i was just sitting down thinking one time yeah i was just like this woman flew from congo to belgium to get given the opportunities that i take for granted yeah her, her schooling wasn't free. Healthcare wasn't free. Nothing was free for her. Like, so she went through all of that and her one dream was for me to graduate. Yeah. So then I was just like, I'm going to graduate just for her. Because I'm a creative. I don't, like, I'm smart, but me being smart doesn't help me. Yeah. Like, I'm not, like, I'm not a doctor or a lawyer. I'm just here, just sitting here smart. Do you know what I mean? So yeah. I was thinking my personality and editing, and that's the stuff I enjoy doing. So I was like, oh, I can just go into that later on in life when I've healed. But then um, that didn't happen. So I went back to uni because that was her dream. So you, you she was never making got bread off YouTube uni. in uni, yeah? Oh, I wasn't really making bread off YouTube. I was yeah. making bread more off of like hair reviews. Like the monthly on YouTube, I wasn't making a no, lot. I was about two, three hundred pounds. Yeah, literally um, less sometimes. But mm. then I was making money more from like um, showing people what hair I had, and then the, I remember the, seeing them. Yeah, the, 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 yeah, yeah, the, yeah, yeah, like oh my god, this hair is so good quality. Yeah. And then so I was making money um, from that, and then a couple deals like you know them apps, the gaming apps that would sponsor. App yeah, that was the first K I ever made. Yeah, um, and I still play the game. Was today. that your first brand or a little rack? Yeah, yeah, yeah. One K. I wonder what mine first was. I don't want to promote. Oh, okay. Shoot, don't have a clue, clue at all. Yeah, yeah, I'll after. But yeah, so um, I was making stacking money for so I was doing app promotions, um, hair reviews, and then all the money you know on the YouTube you can put out a cap. Yep. Like for you for your it. YouTube money, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So I capped it from. So I didn't. I I read. I basically didn't touch that money for years. So when it came to graduation now, so I'd have to move out of. My uni will come to where? to where? Exactly. So from second year, I capped it at 10K. 
Yeah. So then when I graduated, the money, so I was like, I released the cap. So I had 10K and I was just like, okay, cool. I'm going to get myself a place. I'm going to furnish it and I'm so going to save you, it and stuff like as that. As a 21 year old, right? Mm. Was smart enough to think, let me hold down the money. I, I didn't have a choice. Yeah, that's mad. I didn't have a choice, bro. Because, because <coughs> like, after, once I graduated from uni, right around the house in GP's gone. Yeah. My brother's in Belgium. Yeah. GP. Like, yeah. But yeah. I'm saying, but you still had the initiative to say, I, cool, I can't touch this money because I know I need yeah, it after I graduate. Yeah, because I knew. You know, that's not... What, what, I'd have nowhere to stay. That's genuine, like... Why are you so short, though? You're the same. No, yeah. because, bro, I, I, I'm the same as a 27-year-old man, bro. I'm saying me at 20, 19, 21, like, a lot of people will just be like, rah, I got oh, 10 bags and I'm 19. Oh, I'm spending yeah. that. Bro, as an 18 year old, I can't lie, I'm always really spending my cash. Yeah, you get it? Yeah. So it's like, box. what? You saw what was in there? <laughs> Cassine. But obviously, I really respect that. I commend yeah. that, man. Like, mm. the fact that you thought, you know what, I'm actually going to save this money. For real. So you're Thank telling me you. now, after uni, you've now gathered up the bread and said, let me move something on my ones. Yeah. Where did you move? Uh, Royal Wolf. Oh, nice. Yeah. Nice. I had like a studio. It was a one bedroom, but there was no um, there was no door between <laughs> the room and the kitchen. So I put a nice little curtain there. But it was nice. It was a nice place, nice size. But then landlords as well. Like no one talks about how hard it is to rent when you're a YouTuber or when you do these oh, yeah. kind of jobs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like so, for my first and second flat, I hear what you were six months six months in advance. Oh, wow. So you have to pay six months in advance and a uh, deposit. Raw, you lot are going to some dead estate agents or landlords. The baitest ones. The the baitest like ones. Mine, mine was calm. Like I didn't have to do six months up front, Fair but man. I paid a year up front because I like to not to have stress. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, I, I, it just it. Re- yes, I said that that dummy. Man said I was forced, but you had the choice. You said, "Oh, I paid a year up front because I, get, I had the money." Pocket. Years ago, so you had the money. Yeah, when I rich back in the day, like yeah. a couple of years. No, yeah, yeah. Man, yeah. I rich back in the day. If it was yeah. nine, <laughs> not a pot. To if, if it was twenty years old, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. not one pot to really yeah, yeah, yeah. in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really? Can I pay you on a year? Can I pay a five pound? I'll give you my money. Five pound. Yeah, let me give it back. Let me give it back. Yeah. Early YouTube career, man used to mm-hmm. make so much bread, but did not know how to save that I'd ask him to lend me bread. I'd get paid like a seven I'd sheet a month, like a seven racks. I'm like, I chunks, Brody. Just hold me down to ch- Tell them I'm saying all the time, the German. No, it, dep- <laughs> it depended, didn't it? Sometimes two racks, three racks, four, what's sometimes that, five bills. What's the height? I can't remember. What's the most you've let me? Uh, maybe like a 10 gym. Yeah, rack. maybe like a 10 rack. Ah, oh, Charles, eh, the bills, yeah. they're I'm, I'm, getting I'm so him. heavy for me. Philly, yeah, yeah, huh? he was there for me. My bills are getting so heavy for me. Right yeah. yeah. If, if you could just brothers. lend me, if you could just. In fact, not lent. If you could just give me, give ten, me. ten G's what's right ten now. Him? What's what's ten to you? Ain't even see it come. Uh, yeah. uh, what's ten to we him? We heard about the contracts. <laughs> yeah, we heard about the contracts. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, I would like ten yeah. British thousand pounds. Thank you. But yeah, no, no ch- ch- chunks, bro. chunks for sure helped me down when I was when I. Yeah, he was a, he was a bad. It was it was not me trying to highlight the fact I gave you money. It was more the fact that you were very bad at spending money. Terrible. No, no, I, it's not even about spending. It's saving. Man can spend, but you just got to know how much you're I saving think, and I what you're saving. I think you guys are very selfish. Have assets, right? <laughs> no, no. Why I does think... she do this bro yeah. thing? No, you need I've to stop enough. doing I'm that. I'm gonna start highlighting your yeah, thing. Yeah, you need to Bunless. stop doing that. You're rich. Yeah, I, is that yeah, brands that we're not like... in the state right now? What? Yeah. You get me? Cause Little... you ain't paid us for this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Look off Don't let Nella Rose fool you. Yeah. Ask what car she drives. All I'm saying is, yeah, the reason why I act like I'm, I'm the poorest of all my friends. Look at them! No, no, <laughs> no. So, is, what's 10K to you? What's uh, it's cap. a million you know, to you? G- g- I want to ask you a question. What's up? The nails. Where's the, where is the um, inspiration from? My mum. Uh, so, my mum, like, if I was to, sh- I'm going to show you pictures of her, yeah? Like, right, even sure. from her holding me as a baby mm. to, like, her last days, bro. Look, like, but her nails were natural, though. Congolese culture or just Nah, just mom, hers, just, like, no, just her. Nails. Like, so she had long nails. Like, you know in the 90s, the, the oval one, and they'd paint them red. Oh, yes, yeah, yes, Yeah, so she yes, had nails, yes. like, this long, and she just had long nails her whole life, and I just copied her. But I just, I obviously, I take it. Too far, but um, yeah, no, nah, it's just like my thing that I take from her, yeah, long yeah. nails. But hers were real though, mine are fake, hers yeah. were real and strong. At, at what point in your career mm. did you realize, and um, what was it? It might have been a shoot, it might have been a certain number in your account, it might have been something you bought. Did you realize, wow, I've, I've done it? Um, or you might not feel like that now, no, but I feel on. like you do, yeah, no, nah. simply because, like, I'm 
I don't know. Like, I'm not where I think I should be. So then I feel like I when I hit my goals, so, then I can turn around and be like, yeah, yeah, I am. Okay. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, I can I ask you this. Why hours. did you... So you were posting consistently on YouTube. Mm. We randomly lost another lot. We randomly... First of all, they lost you first. Yeah, but we have already spoken about that. Mm-hmm. So let's, mm-hmm. Not, mm-hmm. let's dive over into your situation. Um, this is an assumption. Because you, cause you just... Had, but did it have something to do with your parents? No. So why don't you post on your YouTube? <laughs> <laughs> I like the way he came. The disgust on his face. No, because he, he came with compassion <laughs> yeah. and realised this wasn't. So he said, Yeah, you. wouldn't. Yeah, because I drew her out at a foot asylum shoot mm-hmm. the other day and Harry. That's, I've motivated Harry. Yeah, because by the way, like, yeah. I don't really watch YouTube in general. Yeah, but genuinely, mm. I used to watch your videos. Like, mm. every that's video. how we discovered you. You doing though. hauls, like, about wearing clothes. Why am I? That didn't fit. As a grown ass man watching a girl put on clothes. I used to yeah. like yeah. drinking yeah. Because of yeah. how, how elite and uh, how charismatic she was, yeah? And is. You don't get it. So it's like, even when you and I was at, I'm not going to mention your friends because I don't know if you, who you're friends with now yeah. but like you, know, <laughs> sitting, you know what I mean you just yeah. sitting in amongst and just talking yeah. it was elite content and mm-hmm. you kind of created a, a different uh, type of content you know what I mean I feel yeah, like people yeah, started yeah. to copy and it was yeah. very so, so I want to ask that question like why did you stop and even I was happy to be invited to another Rose video where I actually did a voiceover, the voiceover. Uh, me and uh, Harry. Uh, Harry, yeah, 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 the makeover. Uh, yeah, I watched that one. Is, one Harry thing about, watched. obviously, you know me, I'm not really like the rudest of people on it, yeah? yeah? So when now Nella told me to do it, and she goes, just say what you want. I was like, all right, cool. I just kind of, I was like, he was, lo- be, he was not, lovely. Yeah, I'm not going to be too rude. Yeah. I watched Harry's version. Harry ripped me to shreds. Ripped her to pieces. He and deleted I was like, me. I wish I could redo it. Because <laughs> I would, yeah, because what it is. I would have gone more in. I would have gone more in, because I didn't know it was allowed. Do you get it? Yeah. You're a horrible human. No, 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 no. no but, but yeah. Don't we're, avoid we're, the question. Yeah, right. um, yeah, yeah no, nah, there's two reasons. Actually, kind of three reasons. First reason, um, I was doing a lot of like Foot Asylum and all these other brands that took up way more of my time and made me more money than YouTube. Yeah, so it was very easier for me to just plunge all my time on... Um, the outside jobs outside of YouTube. And then I won't have time for YouTube. Number two is getting bored of my content. So I was mm. just thinking, how many clothes can I try on? How many times can we talk about body counts? Like this is repetitive yeah, now. Yeah. And then number up. three, I wanted to just up the quality of everything. And I just didn't have the time or resources to do that at the moment, at the time. And then the reason why I haven't posted in so long is that I got comfortable in not posting. Yeah. You, you know when you yeah. don't post Similar in, to us to be fair. Yeah. So no, all the reasons you just had is yeah like it's nice doing them foot asylum shoots you get your car outside mm. your lunch is ready you just shoot go home you've mm-hmm. made a madness mm-hmm. and then the other brand deals you get what i'm saying like yeah. no, just, I, I completely com- I understand because i feel like i don't know one uk or british youtuber that has uploaded consistently from the day they started to this, nah, to this nah, nah, and that's nah, why nah. we're all idiots because Jesus. the mentality <laughs> should have been right cool we're making bread here and this one's easy on tuesday but Cool, Thursday, Friday is going to be a bit of a graph, but if I carry mm. on doing this till the end of the month, I'll have double what I've made just from uh, these brands. Hi- hindsight, hindsight, I've... hindsight's a dangerous thing, bro. You're saying now that we'll be idiots, but if we're honest, who's to say now that we wouldn't have made more money doing what we did now than being consistent on our YouTube channel? Like, I know for a fact the amount of money I've made through brand deals, I wouldn't have made that on my YouTube channel. It's a fact. Cheers. Yeah, I, I know Cheers. that. I'm, I'm not disputing Cheers. that, but I'm just saying, had you still done your YouTube, you would have still made... Yeah, but I, I, it's, not, it's, not it's not realistic. It's not realistic because there's times where I was working six days a week. Where am I feeling? Yeah, no, no, I hear you, I hear you. You know what I mean? You remember, bro, I'd call you and I'm in a different country every five minutes. Mm. Like, yeah. how, where would I fit content where I'm filming myself? Yeah. You know what I mean? So it was kind of like, we have to be realistic. But now, obviously, 2023, the brand deals aren't really brand dealing as much as they were. Facts. You know what I mean? What? Facts. Mine are dealing. No, nah, mine are. Mine are. Mm. Mine are. Mm. You're just mad expensive now, <laughs> like. Probably. I can't lie to you. Yeah, yeah, hey, yeah. I get at least a message every day. Yeah, no, I'm not working. Really? I'm, not working. I'm filming with Williams next week <laughs> and Alex Albin. <laughs> Williams! Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Just that got a little crazy. thing with the. You get me? Don't want to say too much, Kai. You didn't pay for the promo in the, in the pod, but. Oh, <laughs> yeah, my team's booming. Nah. Well, your team slowed down. What? Yeah, so brands, I'm cheaper. No, just. I know you have cash. Just give me 20 pounds. Uh, I'm going to get petrol. Yes, you know, I didn't know this, mm-hmm. and I'm ashamed, and I want to big up the producers um, that. Y'all been looking us. into me? Yeah. CRB? I hate this one, Nels. <laughs> Don't be angry at me. You oh, didn't no. know either. Oh, no. So be angry at both of us if you're going to be angry. Oh, no. Do you know what I'm going to say? I'm we scared. didn't know that you had a clothing brand called Faces and it sold out in 30 minutes. Yeah, but then I didn't I didn't stay consistent with that. If I stayed consistent with that, every time I dropped, I sold out. 
within like 30 minutes. I think the last job I did was like an hour sold out. But how many units did you have? If it's 10 tops, then it's not hard, is it? Nah, it was like 500. That's good. 500, so I ordered 600. And then, so I did product shots with like 10 and the rest I gave it to all my friends. And that's why, you know, you clothing lines out there, yeah? Sometimes paying these influencers to wear your top don't work. Sometimes your friends like word to mouth, like some of these clothing lines, like some, my boy will be wearing something. I'll be like, where's that from? And he'll be like, oh, this man. I'll be like, oh, yeah, that's yeah, nice. word, word, like, word. yeah. So I think that helps me a lot. And then obviously me being me. But, no, she um, didn't mean that. She meant give it to the influencers and pass the bag. Because oh, we yes, would please. Love the to Instagram is your popping. Business. <laughs> we will sell your clothes. <laughs> we would love to support them, guys, wouldn't yes, we? 100%. We support businesses and we'll help you grow. Bookings at nellarose.biz. Yes, lost her mind. <laughs> <laughs> Wow. <laughs> <laughs> we would love to help your business grow. Yeah, you know you're annoying. You're grow, annoying. You're annoying. No, that's incredible. Because you know what? I can't lie to you. Brands, they're done with me at this point. So burn all of them. I'm yeah. at that point. Don't worry. We'll, we'll Don't worry. If that. you if you send me all your money right now, I will preserve it. Flip it. And I'll give it back to flip you tomorrow. It, yeah, come back. Come back though. Come back. Faces. <laughs> mm. Why did you get the most... Oh. How do you get too comfortable, bro? Philly you are gets, a jar, Philly, man. guys, no. Behind closed doors, I need everyone to know. Philly gets so frustrated with me. And it's like, no, he's actually my dad. My brother, this is not I'm like, the people are making this much on YouTube. You guys need to be posting consistently. Do, Look, though. go home, stream. I've got a guy that can do your streaming setup. Like, yeah, use the people how, around you. And I'm just like, rah, but I actually haven't slept. This is in the morning, <laughs> by the way. Yeah. It, this, <laughs> <laughs> you owe me 10 bags. <laughs> Hey, my brother spims. <laughs> That's I need compensation for that. I need I need I need like twenty G's for that. No, but she's not lying. I had no, to grill right. her, bro. You know what it is? The fact she says I didn't even wake up for that. Did, did you say you'll give me ten bucks? Yeah, yeah. Flat, yeah. It was early months. That, yeah, it was that, early mornings. It actually yeah. was early mornings. You let her just wake up? No, no, no. Nah, man. Can't Philly, have Philly, eye crust. Like I think I'm, Harry said this the other day. Yeah, Philly. One thing about Philly, he's gonna make some money. And yeah. it, it it killed me, yeah. but he has like a business right, and he doesn't like people like for in Philly's eyes, I'm a bum. Like <laughs> out of all his friends, because it's just like oh. So now in his head, he's thinking. So you had a clothing line, you have a YouTube channel, or you do this with all your friends. He's like, why don't you stream with all your friends? Yeah. And da -da -da -da. You could be making so much money. And I'm just like, bro, rotted. Like I'm just I'm just there getting shouted. At. I thought I think I think it was nine a.m. Mm. But then like all the things, that, all the things that I was. <laughs> Onto you that are mm. at that time is is things that I genuinely love doing. Yeah, I'm addicted to you, streaming. Bro. You it stream at like four a.m. Yeah. Oh, I'm on I was a young Philly with a face cam. What the f? Yeah, yeah, yo, yeah, yeah. So one time, yeah, I think I was on his story at like two a.m. and then I think we had to do CP the next day. CM Captain. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Now big up Captain Morgan, man. Oh yeah, yeah, Captain. Nah, no, so I just no. Nah, nah, oh yeah, yeah. No, sorry, no, no. Cass. Alcohol, alcohol my thing. Yeah, sorry, yeah, sorry, 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 sorry. Sorry, love those. Stuffola, a stuffola. See, I'm, I'm back in your team. Right, so basically he went, streamed, had two hours sleep, yeah. three hours sleep. Something like that and come to the shoot. Came, no, you came. Yeah, I know. Came to the shoot the next day. Back to faces though. So why, seriously though, <laughs> jokes aside, like why, why would you stop that? I don't get it. <laughs> And why would you stop yourself from sending me all the money that you made last year? No, seriously, no. <laughs> stop avoiding the question. Why did you stop faces? And why did you stop oh, commenting on all my Instagram um, pictures because you only did it on once? Nels. Why did you stop this? Oh, it was just it long. It was long. It was long. Like that's a legit. Pain. That's a legitimate answer. But it was, it was like because I was doing what everything did? myself. In there a you sense, go. Where I, it was this like, is this is long for us though, Nels. What? Look at the people behind the camera. Do you think yeah, you no, set this up? No, no. I was doing everything myself ideas. to the like, Yeah, but you so think it's everyone's like, got the same finance resources. That's your yeah, problem as well. Like, Some things are expensive, bro. No, it wasn't even expensive. I'm trying to help time. just be set agree. It, yeah, it was expensive. You know what I mean? <laughs> at the end of the day, you just have to mind the business. You should do it again, man. I know, but it's and just like, so now, like the back and forth of supplies is the quality good. The back and forth of design is do I like the design. The back and forth of how long you can, and then I like I had, so a, I had a, I had a, I had a fulfillment um, company. So basically you send all your stock to them and then they ship it out for you. Man was in Woolwich. Yeah, but no, no, no. Yeah, horror. <laughs> but the Marlies did it. <laughs> no, it wasn't, it wasn't. I think they were like Eastern European, whatever, cool peoples, but I don't think they understood. Like when I told them, oh, it's likely gonna sell out. They were just like, 
yeah, whatever. Like we we deal with a like because one famous. Not I'm not gonna say who they are, but there's a candle company that ship out from there. So then they were just like, yeah, we deal we with do a lot this, of yeah. orders all the time. Da, da, da. So if I'm selling 500 t-shirts in 30 minutes, now all of a sudden you, you're, you you're, un, you're understaffed. you're yeah. understaffed. So then like going back and forth with that. And it was just like, it got to a point where it was stressful. And then having to come up with new designs all the time. And it was just, I was just like, yo, I don't have time for other things. And this is not my main passion. Yeah. So I kind of just chilled out like, with it for a bit. But yeah, the t-shirts were cold. Fair enough. So yeah. what what is what is next for in other words? Like what what are we expecting from you? What are we waiting on? Nothing. Um, no, you know what it is, no, no, no. I don't, don't feel pressure to answer this question because you see when people come up to me now and say, mm. oh, well, "What's next, bro?" Like yeah, I've been, what's there's, next? there's a video what's coming next? out on what's Saturday on the Bitscore channel, bro. And I'm breathing. Yeah, like, I don't know what to say. So I feel like thank you. Yeah, no, you don't have to. Like clap. with with me, like what what I'm doing right now, I'm doing this social media job just to like maintain like obviously my expenses my lifestyle my family but i'm in a stage in my life where i'm trying to get my personal life in order mm. do you get it like i'm just focusing on investing in certain things i've got oh yeah tell projects. the people man you got property blood no they don't tell they, them they, they, they like don't, they in don't belgium have, they're not oh that one but that's yeah? with my sister in bell that's with my sister they got props that's not mine <laughs> serious yeah. no that is sick blood you know no. how many young people like like look how much i spent obviously it's not mine it's with my yard, sister you get me but for the family account she's trying to say she wants her own shizer yeah i hear it that's yeah. a boss girl yeah but yeah i'm trying to like but well done though like thank you, you. that was put money in the right yeah. places do you do you still have uh love for your job like do you still have passion and you still enjoy what you're doing uh i don't think so no i feel like i my main passion was filming with my friends editing and posting on my channel and i've gotten to a stage where i don't even do that anymore um i feel like sometimes with when you work with brands it's like like i was saying this to philly the other day yeah, like you booked oh. <sighs> you booked nella rose yeah and or you booked young philly yeah and we show up on set and you're basically telling us not to be ourselves yeah shoot bro yeah yeah, yeah yeah so you're telling us not to be ourselves and to be this version of us that you've created in your head okay oh, you suddenly instead yeah, please oh, oh, oh bro like basically bring back you and this is who we want you to be and then on top of that it's like but when you were seeing me on social media i wasn't acting like this mm. like me and philly or if we're on social media ha, 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 laughing like <laughs> that's who we are mm. and then i feel like these brands just want to tailor you to them but it's like you didn't i didn't become nello you didn't become philly or chunks by being this person that like these brands want you yeah. to be the only time i hear it yeah sorry i think the only time I hear it is like on red carpets. Obviously, like you're gonna have to be poised and present. But yeah, I'm getting a lot of that these mm. days. Like. But I am willing to tailor myself yes. to you. Because <laughs> <That's laughs> if you want to book me, I am the person that tailors around your company. Yep. Yes. So book Philly for tailoring. Because yes. <laughs> this doesn't last forever. And I need you to give my mum at least five week. more yards. So Literally. book me you know, for tailoring. You know Philly's in a rush. He keeps telling us like, you know Philly thinks YouTube is ending tomorrow, by uh, the way. And I, do you know what tomorrow. Well, he's right, though. He, he is. Right. I know I YouTube's why. dying, he but he's every like- every single day like it's your last it's effing day. Because you see right now, man's man got all the brand deals. Tomorrow I say something wrong, guess what? All the money are gone. Yeah, True. No, yeah, yeah, so lying. what now then? True. You yeah, have to respect it. No, Make all the effing bread you can right now because this job is volatile mm. and it's very time sensitive. And there's people that used to be 10 times bigger than us back in the days. And where are they now? Where are they? That's now? true. That, that's what scares me. That's what scares me. It's not a dig. It's not anything. It's yeah. the truth. Yeah. So I can't lie. I completely get your standpoint, but yeah. unfortunately, the way my uh, uh. passion and work rate is set up, we can't. Yeah. Mm. And that's just all it is. And it's gonna be a thing where maybe when I'm now 35 and I'm not doing this anymore, and I'm thinking, mm, I could have made more money than there, and I could have done more things there, and I couldn't enjoy my life. I would but hate that. I, 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 I was gonna most likely have a. Because at the end of the day, now if I said to you now, are you working as hard as you could be? There you go. That's but that's what that's what wow. that's what Philly says to me indirectly every time he speaks. <laughs> yeah, well, basically. But then obviously you have to understand he's, he's talking from a place of I care yeah. about you, you know. Yeah. Because 
you don't want to ever, ever look back and think, I regret not working as hard as I should have in my 20s. But then also, you don't want to look back at your 20s and think, I was a working horse and I didn't actually even have so any. But, but that's what I'm saying. So like, balance, balance. So like, for example, I could go like months of like doing like five shoots a week, like boom, 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 yeah. boom. But then you're just drained. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. But then, it, and it's like, sometimes like I'll be waking up like, cause obviously I've got to do hair and makeup before I come on set, yeah. yeah. So, yeah. so then it's like, I'm waking up at 4 a.m. and I'm like, why am I working this hard? Like, especially mm. when you financially, you've gotten yourself to a stage where you're comfortable. Uh -huh. It's like, why am I w working like when mm. I didn't have like, so so when does it sink in that actually you can chill out a little bit? That like, yeah. actually you can work, like, but not as hard. Like yesterday, Chunks was meant to film mm. and then my mum called him and then uh, she called me back. She was like, yeah, Chunk canceled it because he said he's tired. And then today yeah. I called Con. And I also told him we're canceling because I'm about to film two eps for the pod, oh. and I'm knackered. Do you get what I'm yeah. saying? So yeah. that's the thing. I've actually prioritised man's man's health. health yeah. Almost, uh, now more than the securing the bag, I'm, at, I'm yeah. at a good place right now where I can balance it. But we have to understand that now, with the more money we make, the more of expensive lifestyle we have and, and maintenance we have. Mm. So you have to work even harder because of the fact that Nella in 2018 might have spent a grand a month or a half grand and a half a month. But that's, that's a lot of money. Yeah, but Nella in 2023 uh. is now spending X amount and it's like three yeah. or four yeah. times. Yeah. So it's like, unfortunately, because of your spending, you have mm. to make more money. But do you know, do you know why I get drained quickly? Um, do, doing this job like for example my friends yeah they can go to work clock in at nine clock out at five and more time it's like it's work where it's like you have to use your skills like your intellect and boom boom you get your lunch break you dip and say i'm shooting five days a week for a month straight i have to go hi friends i'm there all day five days a week for a month straight and it's like sometimes i just don't have the energy yeah, to no, be and I, energetic and, and, on and camera is, like i can i can empathize with you because of the fact that i'm on the same boat but outside looking mm. in you're making 10 times more what someone else is making piss off and and, and stop uh, stop complaining about it. keep doing it you know what i'm trying to say mm. Boys, this is what mm. the, i'm kidding you know why at the end of the day bro we're the minority in this in this like equation you have to understand that there's millions of people watching us day in day out and in their heads they don't think it's hard work with them. Oh yeah. So, so at yeah, the end of the day, they, they will never be able to empathize and think, why are you complaining mm. when you're making this much and you're just flipping entertain us? Just shut up and keep making those videos, please. They shut up. Genuinely, no? Mm. Yeah, yeah no, I agree. So it's like, but I have to actually take in what we're saying when we're talking to the people at home mm. right now. So it's like, I hear where they're coming from, but you're also- We're not, not complaining. Yeah, no, of course. But I'm saying now- It's I'm just, just a little yeah. tiring sometimes. And I'm definitely not complaining. And why is that? I really? love my job and I love the brand. Yes, so tell them about that. Please home. keep on booking me. <laughs> yes. <laughs> love you all. Big period. Yeah. Um, I just love this. <laughs> you know that's my favorite thing to do that. What? Well, like that because well, we love promo. the brand. <laughs> <laughs> and if you, you know that's my favorite thing. When you do that. Because you're basically saying, "Low my bag, let me just keep <laughs> I'm trying to more. get the money. I'm trying, trying to, to get to the there. money. <laughs> Mom's is living good. <laughs> big period. That's the dream. Do you do? Any, have you done any work with brands that uh, you didn't want to do? But obviously the bag was too big, so you felt me have to do it. Yeah. No, she <laughs> means absolutely no one. <laughs> yeah. Because we love you all. <laughs> nah, yeah. Is there any brands you wouldn't work with, Philly? <laughs> no. <laughs> love you, love you, love you all. Give me a call and I'm there. Is there any brands you haven't worked with that you want to work with? Um, No, I've done it now. Formula One. Ooh. That's what I wanted to do, really. That, yeah, that's your favorite sport. Yeah. yeah. What about Trojan? I remember you said something about What's that? that? The, What's the, that? The condom one. Oh. Brand. And Durex, you said you wanted to do that. No, no, my mom, my mom of a Magnum. You, yeah, sorry, I'm with Sis right now, man. Yeah, no, but I'm saying there's nothing wrong. It's just protection. Yeah. Obviously, you said you wanted to work with them. So would you do that? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, sorry. I mean, <laughs> there we go. Yes, I would because we love you. And we love protection. <laughs> so give us a call and we'll be on the ball. <laughs> Disgusting! Yeah, no, give us a corner on the ball. Oh yeah, yeah, Disgusting! Yeah, hard. Disgusting! There you go. Philly's a brand. How about you? Is anyone you like to work with? That you haven't, obviously. That I haven't worked with. I think. I think you made me want to work with an airline brand now. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, shout out to Qatar Airways. Yo, tell them what Qatar Airways does for you, please. Yeah, no, they look after me, and I really love Qatar. We love you. <laughs> and me and Nella would love the opportunities yes. you give to our friend Chunks. Thank you. So give us a call and we're on the ball. <laughs> you and this on the ball. <laughs>
<laughs> no. <laughs> Guys, they fly him and all his Bro, friends' business. It's, yeah. the, it's the best airline 10 years in a row. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Great services. Yeah. <laughs> Look at Shout it. me, man. Because <laughs> you know we can get a deal. Yeah. No, no Qatar no. Airways is actually a joke. Filet mignon steak in the sky. What? what? That's not right yeah, for no life. one. Give you pajamas for the jammies. Yeah, no, nah, you know I've Give got about five jams. of them pairs. <laughs> Six of them. <laughs> Blue with the grey. That's the greatest combination. I wear it in my yard. I got the Urgandy. You ain't got the Urgandy <laughs> set. No, that's, that's, that's Virgin. Chunk. Urgandy's Virgin. No, nah, no, nah, it, it's Stefo Qatar. I ain't virgin got, I ain't got one of them pajamas, you know. you never been in business at Qatar? No. I'll take you it. need to. You need my life. It's cold. It's cold. My life. I think it's cold. My life. It's actually and, cold. And can I get um, maybe a little upgrade to first class? To so go where though? What? You Qatar. Can go to what do you buy? You can go to. No, you can't go to Dubai. They're best fly Emirates. Can I got beef there? But guess what? We love Qatar. Qatar. Yeah. Airways. Yes, we do. But I also love fly. All oh, right. This is getting <laughs> stupid. This is getting stupid. You're supposed to fly anywhere. And we'll be here every day. Listen, I'll get on flipping Avianca if the bread's right. <laughs> 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 I mean, I I want Air India. <laughs> Anything. I sing up. There. I'm telling yeah. you. Oh. I sound that's cold though. I've I tried that there. one, yeah. I'm, I'm out, you do easy jet right now. Eh? Yeah. Well, I'll do bro, you lot think this is. And this if the bag is I think right. You'll be there with a little suitcase. Please make sure you book him in Egypt. <laughs> and then the week after, I'm going to go, British Airways. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. You know, bro, is he Philly? Bro. Money maker. Yeah. Money man. Him. I'm not Egypt. No, money man. <laughs> yeah. I hear it. Um, Let us know in the comments quickly, guys. Would you be like Philly or would you be like me? More selective or would you be like Philly where I'm looking after my parents? Give me the bag. And no, no, but so are you though. Say you've got to be careful with how you word things because then they're going to think, what, so you don't look after your parents? You're the same, no, but of course. Mm. he's just, yeah, he's just like, no, nah, this, that, I want yeah. it to look like this. So, and to, when to he looks back, brand. I want him to go, oh, this, this, yeah, yeah, and that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why he done it connected. Whereas I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I hear it. Let, let, let All aboard. <laughs> anything you want to say? Yeah. Um, yeah, anything you want to say before you head off? Uh, not really. Okay. But... <laughs> <laughs> Not even thanks for having me on. Nah, it's cool though, it's cool, it's cool. It's okay. cool, it's cool. That's you know like, what? she knew why she was what? coming, quick promo nah. for my thing. Nah, it's cool, love. Yeah, Bro, it's promote? because I know that we're gonna still be here for like another hour or yeah, two. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. I'm just like. I'm about, I'm about to order food right now. No, yeah, but, but anything you actually wanna promote? Is there anything um, that you got? Nope. Well, face nope. is not coming out because nope. you're lazy. <laughs> no, but what thank you guys for having me on. A clothing brand, brand. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I'm saying, obviously, we, we, my, we, I don't think we said it was her clothing Bro, brand. Bro, it's did. dissolved. <laughs> dissolved is dissolved. crazy. Dissolved. Not coming back. Okay. Dissolved, as in the company is dissolved. Yeah, dissolved. But, <gasps> yeah. Yeah. but yeah, I just, no, there is one thing that. I do want to say. I'll invest in that. There's, it sounds like in what, 30? 30, yeah. We could talk. <laughs> See, Serious. money. Serious. He's just seeing money in his head. So I was like, in what? 30 hey. minutes. Yeah. That's like if I put aside, I I'm going to get. Yeah, in there. Faces, we love, love you. you. What? Out <laughs> early next year. <laughs> New designs. All the time. Yo, that's all right. Yo, that's all right. New all designs. All, right. <laughs> all the time. Oh my so God. Good. But Nella, we want to say thank you very much yeah. for being on the podcast. Thank you for having me. You have been one of our favorite guests ever. Really? Yeah. 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 Do you say that to every guest? No. 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 Hand on heart, we, we don't. Watch yeah. when you come out. I think I said it once to Harry because I really like Harry's episode. And that Darkest you, was my brilliant. My own cousin well. was there, but I didn't tell him that. Uh, shout, Harry Pinero was brilliant Darkest. as well. Yeah. Um, and please, mm -hmm. I hope you find, in God's name, I hope you find the courage to release that video. I will, I will. Can I watch it? Yeah. Thank you very much. Yeah. I will. Do you know what? Bad. I'll probably send it to you lot and be like, guys, is it bad? How would it be bad? Because <laughs> overthinking. Is that the first time you're going to let out, just before we go quickly, last question. Is that mm -hmm. the first time you're going to let out real ass emotions with no filter on YouTube. Yeah. yeah. Got me deep your topic though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All yeah. right, um, anyway guys, thank you so much for watching. And if you haven't watched, thank you so much for listening on wherever you listen to this too. Um, God bless you. Have a great day. Um, and get out the wank pit and do something positive today. Yeah. Take <laughs> on. And quickly last second to the brand. We love yeah. you! Yeah. Period. All right, bye. Send the money. Send the money.